Hey guys, Dracovich here, and today we're going to be going over how to make legendary pile spheres fast. So the first thing you're going to want to do is get a base set up for farming ore automatically. You're going to need a pile deck, a feeding box, a hot spring, and some beds. I also set up a ranch for mine so that it feeds itself. I'll leave a link in the description to the location of this base. The next thing you're going to need is some bones. So you can come to the dune shelter, the town found in the middle of the desert in the northeastern part of the map. Inside you'll find three merchants. You're going to want to grab at least the red merchant and throw Pal Ball into his back for the back bonus. Because this gives you the best odds of catching him. You don't want to attack him or the guards try to kill you. If you can get him low it'll actually help catch him. But if he dies, uh, you can just leave and come back and then he'll respawn. So don't even worry. Once captured, the wandering merchant can be placed at your base and you can then be traded with. You can buy bones straight from them, as well as other resources that you'll need. If you find yourself running out of gold and you need extra for bones, you can always take nails that you make from your ore, bring it to the merchant, then you can sell it to him for gold and buy yourself a ton of bones. Now the last ingredient we need is PAL fluids. So we're going to come over to Gobbin Turf and we're going to go looking for Gobbins because they drop PAL fluids. And if you happen to bring an Ozerk, it has a special ability that allows you to gain extra drops from water PALs up to 40%. And if you condense Ozerk down to plus 4, you'll actually drop up to 80% extra. So here you'll see I'm getting about two fluids each. So our last step is going to be crafting cementing paste from all the materials we've gathered. So you're going to come over, you're going to craft your cementing paste. Then you're going to come over to the electric furnace and you're going to make PAL ingots, as many as you can. And if you don't have paladinium fragments at this point, start turning uh, stone into fragments. And then you're going to come over and you're going to craft your legendary spheres. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you later.